Um, but a little bit about myself first. Um, so when I was a young child, I was uh, in a gifted and talented program, which is a special set of classes that teachers have come up with to help certain students do better in school by avoiding distractions like having friends. Uh, so that, that worked pretty well, and uh, I ended up going to graduate school for philosophy. Um, a lot of people don't really know what that means. It means that I was poor. Uh, very poor. So I used to deal with that by window shopping. I'd like to go and kind of look at the things that I knew as a grad student that could never afford, like $800 Prada shoes or food. <laughs> this, is, this is in LA, by the way, where I was in grad school. And uh, I got to say, overall, I really loved it there. Um, fun city, the whole celebrity culture, celebrity gossip. I love celebrity gossip, uh, all of that. Um, a lot of people think if you like celebrity gossip, it means you're uh, shallow or stupid. But those people don't appreciate what celebrity gossip gives to us, you know? It's, it's tough out there. And after I spend the day hearing about unemployment and uh, corruption on Wall Street and global warming, hell yes, I want to know who the Kardashians are fucking. <laughs> I do try to be appropriate with my language, and uh, I realize it should be whom the Kardashians are <laughs> But uh, I, I don't think celebrities get enough credit. I really don't. You know, it's not easy just managing all the stuff they have to deal with, leaking your sex tape, you know, and hearing a nipple slip. You guys ever think about that? Nipple slips, I mean, wow, that's kind of embarrassing, huh? Like, can you imagine if you went out one day and you're wearing something a little too low cut and like, boom? popped out. Like suddenly the whole world knows the horrible truth that like you have nipples. <laughs> but uh, I do like to follow what's going on in the world, celebrities and otherwise, you know. Uh, Jamie Dimon has been in the news a lot lately with the whole uh, trading loss with JP Morgan. Did you hear about this? They lost like three billion dollars. He's gonna maybe have to testify in front of Congress. It's like mayhem. So I'm just watching the news and seeing how he's responding and, and thinking like Oh my god, he's kind of cute. Is that horrible? Look, at least it's not like I'm into Scott Peterson. And that guy was seriously hot. <laughs> no one likes to talk about this, but it's true. He was like the Dean Kane of Psycho Killer. <laughs> my previous celebrity crush was uh, John Edwards. Remember him? Ran for president, had an affair. Oh, I guess that doesn't narrow it down that much. Um, <laughs> he had really good hair. Yeah, now you kind of remember. Anyways, um, but we don't really need to focus on celebrities. I mean, there's so many other ways to stalk and follow people. We've got Facebook, right? Do you guys do Facebook? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Do you that thing where you log in and ask for your phone number? It's like, really, guys? You couldn't even buy us a drink first? <laughs> anyway, I'll leave you guys in your drinks. Thanks, everyone. You're great.